What's up guys, it's Matt over here at the Vault DTX. I'm Matt. This is Logan. We're here, right outside the store right now. We'll take y'all inside, do a little tour. Let's get into it. All right guys, so since this is the first video, we're trying to do like a little quick store tour and then we'll do like a little full day at the shop type vlog. I wanted to do bring those uh, full days at the shop from TikTok into YouTube now. So it's gonna be a lot longer for you guys because I think you guys would enjoy that. And yeah, but uh, Logan, you wanna take them through the first part of the store? So uh, right off the bat, we got some 80s and 90s uh, posters right here. Got the Dream Teams, we got Jordan, we got a Lakers one right here. And then over here, we got Jordan next to the roller. This is the life-size one. Everyone loves this one. Everyone loves this one. But uh, the, what do you call it? The trim. The trim. So uh, yeah, it's, it's not, not actual It's not your actual height, yeah. if you're wondering. <laughs> Everyone wondering, always wondering. If you're wondering why you're so short or something. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. And then uh, over here, we got a little BHS. We got Space Jam playing all day. And we got some uh, trinkets and such on the floating shelves. Got some shoes on there. These shoes are for sale as well. Got a vault right here. This is an actual bank vault that they have at Banks. Uh, shout out Mr. Oscar, Matthew's dad. The plug. He hooked it up. <laughs> uh, yeah, really dope piece. Really yeah. like it. Fits uh, perfectly with our name, I think. Um, but yeah, then after that, I mean, kind of the main attraction of the store, the shoe wall. Uh, heat, older heat, newer heat, we got everything. Uh, another thing is our prices are very good. I know a lot of people think every store taxes. That's not true. We're not one of those stores. So come in, see for yourself. I promise you our prices are not too bad. Um, definitely a little room for us to make some money, but for you guys to still be happy in my opinion. But we got a lot of heat. I mean, we got some older heat. Got Mocha 3s, White Cement 4s, Motorsports, Pure Money 5s, Toros. We got two pairs of green gloves down here. I mean, just, just cooler stuff you don't see every day at every store because I feel like a lot of times every store nowadays is nothing but dunks and Nothing else cool, um, honestly. But uh, yeah, we got a lot of good stuff here and um, great prices too, so come check us out. Over here, we've got probably my second favorite part of the store. We'll get to my first favorite part of the store in a second, but over here we've got the vintage wall. Um, grails on grails, man. You wanna take them through a few uh, key pieces, Logan? Be a pleasure. Uh, so we got some Bulls wrap tees, we got Lakers tees, USA Dream Team. Larry Bird, another Bulls rap tee right there. Um, a big theme here is just like 90s basketball, honestly. Um, this one we got the other day, pretty random. Someone just brought it in. Something you don't see every day. You never know what's gonna come through that door. If, if you know, you know. If you know, you know. I'll leave it at that. Oh, I'm gonna show this one, because this one's actually pretty dope. Oh, yeah, Donkey it's, Kong, it's uh, piece, man. Nintendo 64T, front and back. He's back on the back. Pretty dope though. I actually, uh, look, you might wear this. Uh, you might see this on my back and then back up on the wall if you guys don't mind. Honestly, I might, might throw that on one day. Um, and then over here, you just got a, you know, your typical Supreme and antisocial and Travis Scott, all that, all that uh, good stuff, I guess. <laughs> we got all that. Uh, this side is all gonna be like, like uh, rapper merch. So we've got Travis, uh, Playboy Cardi, Kanye, and I think I think that's it for now. I've got some Kid Cudi CPFM stuff on the way too, so stay tuned for that. And then we've got more of like the streetwear type brands over here, I guess. Uh, we've got Antisocial, v and Babe, Supreme, um, some other random ones, Hidden NY. Uh, I don't know, let me see. Some uh, Cause, so yeah, just like some cool stuff in this rack as well. And then my number one favorite part of the store, what I was getting to earlier, the lounge, me and Logan, uh, come here quite often to clear our thoughts and uh, just ponder, you know, just uh, really just sit down and have um, just a good time, you know? It's a nice little area over here. Uh, uh, you got jokes over here. You got, the, you got the Jordan, you got the Barkley, you got the Kemp, you got the Worthy, man. You got, you got all that, all that good stuff. And uh, uh, over here we got our merch rack. Uh, we're, we're restocking it for you guys since you guys obviously left us so much because this is literally all we have left is this, uh, these Order. five shirts right here. Order. They're Order. all Order. double XLs. Yep. So. You guys really liked it, so we're gonna bring it back again. Uh, any big yeah. boys that want to come grab some, come grab it. This is all we got left right now. We will be restocking, so any small boys and medium boys will uh, get. We got. We'll show some love to y'all too as well soon. Um, but yeah, we, like I said, we printed 100 tees of these and pretty much sold out on day one. So that's crazy. Thank you guys for the support, man. It's been insane. Um, but yeah, we'll definitely got some more ideas coming up. Not just to restock on these, but you know, Kobe, uh, Dirk. We are in Dallas. Uh, I don't know. We got some things. Shaq. Yeah. Just uh, stay tuned. Got some, some things, things in the world. Absolutely. 
Um, and then over here, another, uh, I feel like every part of this store is my favorite, but another favorite part of my, the, the store right here, we got the key case uh, up right here right at the front counter. Don't be afraid to ask if you guys want to see anything. It's all wrapped, so don't worry. You can touch it, see it. Um, maybe not try it on, but you can see it and look at it. <laughs> if you guys want anything up here, just feel free to come up. Um, we don't bite. Just let us know uh, what you want to see. We can grab it out for you guys. can check it out, take a picture. Uh, that's another thing. A lot of people always ask us, can we take pictures of the store? Can we take pictures of the shoes? Yeah, why not? <laughs> Obviously, yeah, sure. That's what, that's, what, that's what we made it so cool for you guys, so you guys could uh, enjoy it and take pictures and share with your friends and stuff. But yeah, don't be afraid to ask if you guys want to see any heat in here. And uh, I mean, while we're at it, Logan, uh, could, I see, could I see some heat in here? Yeah. If you don't mind. Uh, yeah, so uh, a lot of things I don't see a lot, a lot of other stores have are like older uh, SBs and stuff. So I think that's something that... Uh, try my that, best on, yeah. That we do well. Stumps. Yeah. Some heat. Hopefully uh, some uh, great older pieces right here. Supreme, just got these in the other day. First time seeing this color in hand is actually very nice. It's like a, almost like a maroon brown, but they're pretty cool. I like them. And then got not one but two of oh these brother. puppies. Oh brother, you need these, man. Rolls grails. Uh, you need these. Yeah, I do. You need these. Forest. I need those too. Fire. You need these. Those are your size, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shout out to the vault. Yes, sir. Yeah. Um. All you can see is some more stuff you see, you've probably seen before, but uh, just a cool little yeah. highlight pieces right here. Um, like I said, if you guys ever want to see it or anything, just come up, feel free to ask. And something I actually do want to show y'all, something else I do want to show y'all. Got a nice little, uh, not clothed vintage wall, I guess. It's just cool little posters and stuff. Little 80s magic poster right there. Uh, another 80s MJ poster. It's not the early 90s, maybe early 90s on that. Winx poster, everyone loves that. And yeah, just some cool little knickknacks here and there, you know what I mean? Dennis, MJ. Also, if you guys want to try anything on, we've got the Bulls locker room for you guys right here. Um, so. Feel free to ask to try any clothes on and uh, show them inside that too. We made it nice and pretty in there as well. So Ooh. we got some uh, cool little posters in there as well. Slam jam and uh, nice little mirror as well. Sure. Mirror. Nice little mirror. Shout out to my dad for that mirror. I really appreciate it, dad. It's a dope mirror. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then <laughs> that's an inside joke for my dad if he's watching. You know. uh, but then uh, we got some, uh, also got this yesterday. Um, a little uh, bear brick, a thousand percent bear brick. He's holding the, the extra Atmos that we got. Um, but yeah, that's about it for the store tour, guys. Um, we're about to get into a full day of the shop, so uh, let's go ahead and get into it. What's up, guys? It's Matt at the Vault DTX over here. This is episode one of Full Day at the Shop. Super excited about this, guys. Um, yesterday, we did a little store tour um, of the whole store and all the cool things we've got in here. And today, we're going to be doing a Full Day at the Shop episode one. I know you guys loved it on TikTok, so I thought... Let's bring it over to YouTube. I'm really excited about this, but uh, we got some new arrivals real quick. That's what we always start the TikToks with, so we're gonna stay to stay with that theme. We'll start with the new arrivals. Um, we've got quite a bit of nice things right here. Um, so right, start right off the bat. We'll start off with the Solomon Hidden NY collab. Never thought these would actually come in, um, but yeah, pretty cool. I'm not a big fan of the Solomons, but I know a lot of people are really liking them right now, and apparently they're very comfortable and just good for like all day wear. But um, this is a good colorway. If I were to get any colorway, it'd definitely be these. But yeah, cool little shoe right here. We got them at 450. Great price. Pretty sure that's like under StockX ask. So no, we do not price match unless you want to get charged more for these. <laughs> uh, we got the University Blue Jordan ones as well right here. One of our best movers. The size six and a half wide on here, 285. One, once again, can't complain about that price, man. Uh, some dazzling blues. This came in the same buyout with these. Size seven on these, 295. Hey, man. I hope you guys are liking the prices because I, I, I sure as hell am. So I hope you guys are enjoying them. I'm really trying to keep them good and keep them reasonable because I know a lot of stores nowadays are ridiculous with that. But I think our prices are very good and um, I think you can really have a good shop, good shopping experience in here without breaking the make, honestly. Um, but yeah, we got the Fragment Dunks right here as well. DS 160. Once again, I believe that's retail. So yeah. Um, and then right here, this is a special order. So this one's not hitting the shelf. This was for a client. Steve, shout out to Steve. Um, this is the Travis Scott Air Max 1 in the Baroque brown colorway. Very nice shoe. Probably up there with one of my favorite shoes this year. Oh, but these these technically dropped last year in Houston, but they the, the main release was this year. So I still consider them a release this year because that Houston release was probably a few hundred pairs or a few thousand pairs. This The main release just happened just a couple months ago. But yeah, I'm really liking this shoe. I actually really like the satin gold colorway as well. 
Um, but yeah, these are clean, dead stock for Steve. And yeah, if you guys ever need like a special order, I can try my best. I can't promise them, um, but if you guys ever need something in particular and you're local and you need it like within a week, I can always try my best to do that. Um, but yeah, this, these are actually these I was actually able to find for him the same day um, that he requested them, so that was pretty cool. He's coming to pick them up today, or he should be. Um, but yeah, that's just a little few of the new arrivals. I'm sure we'll get some more throughout the day. Um, we've got a long day ahead of us. It's only like 12 o'clock. We're open until eight, so. Hopefully we can get some buyouts on camera, some, some sales. Um, but yeah, let's get into the full day at the shop, episode one. All right guys, quick fit check. Uh, you know we always do the on-feeds on TikTok, so I'm gonna kind of keep that same theme. We got the, up top we got the Vault DTXT, restock coming soon. The classic LA Stussy hat. I get clowned for this one, but uh, Never gonna stop wearing it, guys, sorry. Uh, Stussy shorts, right here. These were very expensive, but I wanna say worth it, but they're really not. I wear them a lot, though, so I guess they are kinda worth it. And then on feet, we've got the off-white Air Jordan 2s in the white and red colorway. Love this shoe, one of my favorite shoes. One of my favorite releases of last year. These are very sick. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys. This is what I was talking, I don't know if it got mentioned yesterday in the store tour, but whenever I have to restock the wall, this is kind of what I'm talking about. It's very annoying. So we've got three spots open right now. We've got a little overflow right now, but this is extremely annoying. So like, I've got to get this shoe to fit all the way down here. So it's gonna be a lot of adjusting. Um, so basically I just have to go one by one and drop these down one by one all the way till we get to that. I'm not gonna do that in the video because that's gonna be a long video, but yeah, that's, I like this wall and I don't, but yeah. Is she a 12 and a half? You think cash? Oh, Steve came in with this 12 and a half. He needed a size 11 and uh, Got it for him in like a day or two, right? Pretty quick. Yep. Uh, okay, yeah. Let's do the side swap for him. Yeah, I got you. I got you. Thanks, man. Always a pleasure, man. Always a pleasure. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Like I said, I did a little special order for him. He got his son, the Travis Scott Air Maxes. Um, he brought his 12 and a half to side swap for the 11 that I bought for him. And he had a 50 bucks, just, uh, you know, a little tip for me, you know, a little pocket change. But yeah, appreciate you, Steve, coming through, man. He's always, uh, he's, he's always supporting. But yeah, let's keep it going. Instagram always eats first. You already know. Please go follow us at The Vault DTX on Instagram if you have not already. Post all our new arrivals on there. Instagram's always popping for you guys. Got a little Travis Air Max that we just got from Steve. Nice little picture though. You know, nice aesthetics. Y'all already, already know the vibes. Just get the pictures going. Instagram's always popping for y'all. But yeah, let's get it posted up. Y'all just saw the process of the Instagram pictures, so now, um, if y'all don't know, if you haven't been to the store before, all of our shoes are wrapped. Now, I've been getting a lot of questions about how to do this. It's actually uh, pretty simple. Um, at first, I thought this was pretty hard, um, but after just getting some work with it, some practice with it, you got it down pretty well. What's going on guys? Welcome in. How you doing? How you doing? But now, put the plastic in here. And the way you want to do it is you want the toe to be right here at this point. The least, the, the least amount of points possible because these points kind of are hard to shrink. So you'll get that point. Then you go with the cutter right here. Cut all the access off. Remove that. Remove. That. It's like a heat press, it takes it off and, and seals it too. So like it's not just cutting it, it's sealing it to plastic as well. Um, so like I said, get all the points off. And then, my favorite part, the heat gun. Get your heat gun, let it heat up for a second. And once it's nice and ready, you go in on it. And it kind of shrinks the plastic like that. Pretty dope, pretty satisfying in my opinion to watch it all shrink down, but yeah, that's pretty much the process and uh, I'll show you guys once it's all done. Here's the finished product, nice and uh, 
pack tight. But yeah, man, that's pretty much the little process. I mean, it takes, I don't know, 10 seconds to wrap a shoe. Maybe like 20 seconds, maybe like 20 seconds to wrap a shoe. But yeah, it's quick, easy, and um, it keeps people from touching them and getting them dirty. And some people that just don't know what these shoes are and like what they're worth and just kind of just grabbing them and trying them on. That was kind of a big thing for me I didn't like. So that's why they're wrapped. But yeah, that's the process of it. It's quick, simple. And now we uh, tag them up and put them out on the shelf. So yeah. There he is, the man. Yeah, yeah. I'm literally just trying to find in my apartment. I, just, I hate the white, bro. I'm gonna be honest with you. These are fire, dude. You really don't like the them? Way better. I don't know, man. I like these a lot. But uh, yeah, the size 11, right? Yeah. I already paid. Wait, did I pay you? No, I did not pay you. Oh, I might want to store credit. You want to store credit? Let me see the borrows. It's a 12, right? Yes. Lucky. Should I get them back? Yeah. Absolutely. I, I sold them. my pair and I like low key kind of regret it. I might go to the lab and buy those size 11. I'll drop on the, I already told you I'll do 550 for you, so I'll just give you, so we're doing, I'll do 150 cash on our credit. It was 140 cash. Yeah, I'll do, I'll do 150 credit. I already, I'll drop on the 550 for you though. Can I see the other one? Yeah. Let's go grab. It's a great pair, man. It's a great pair. I love that shoe. All of our SBs are right here. Sir. Yeah, brother. A crispy pair for the one and only. Mine were cooked. <laughs> yeah, they were. <laughs> Mine were cooked. <laughs> Yeah, just in-store buyouts at the moment, guys. We got too much stuff coming in in-store to be worrying about shipments coming in, so. Yeah, maybe if it starts getting slow in-store buyout-wise, then maybe, but it's still, it's been pretty steady, so not, not at the moment. I don't think, bro. Just let me know, man. Should we go bigger for a little bit? Yeah. Think on it. It's a good friend, These are the uh, new Soleil Bembury uh, Crocs and the Stratus color, is that what they're called? Stratus? I've heard Stratus, I've heard almost white, I've heard... They all we'll have just, like three names. We'll just make it simple, the white colorway. These are cool though, I like these. I got myself a personal pair of these. And Daniel's selling them to us for 140, and I told him 150 credit, so... I guess he's gonna be thinking on the paras, and uh, yeah. Nice little pair. This is a, these are definitely cool. I think these will move pretty quickly. Here we go. Yeah, my uncle used to work for Nike. Oh, he, gave it to me. he gave it to me like over 20 years ago, and Dude, I've had it ever gas. since. I don't know. I don't know what it's worth though. It's old. Like it's old. Dude, can it's I buy it off you? Uh, what's your offer? I don't know. I, mean, I don't know what they're worth either. Because this, I, I, this is what I found, and I'm not expecting this, obviously. Yeah. God, dude. How much do you want, dude? I, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what it's worth. I want to hang it, dude. That's the only thing. Oh, the holes. The holes. <laughs> that was like on my childhood bedroom for like 15 years until I moved out and went to college. And then it was sitting in my closet for. It'd be dope, like ever. over the Jordan one, maybe? I think it'd be pretty cool here, man. Look how perfect it would fit right here. That'd be pretty cool. What do you want, Daniel? I don't know what it's worth. I don't... I'm not just gonna like let it go for nothing, but like I, I really don't know what it's worth. I just brought it. Check like eBay comps. We'll check. <laughs> Bro, I look. I can't find anything anywhere. I'm look up. I looked last night. I could. The only thing I could find was that one listing of that red one. For five hundred dollars. You couldn't see any sold listings. Well, what do you even Google when you look at that sign? Nike, swoosh. Is it nineties? I've had it since like the nineties. I've literally had that. Since the, I, the earliest memory I have of that is when I was like seven or eight years old. Nike swoosh. And I, I very well could have had it. Before, I guess. What did you look up? I just typed in vintage Nike sign. 
And that red one popped up. Vintage Nike sign. Yeah, here's the red, here's one. the red one. But that's all. The only other place I've seen this sign is on Round Two's Instagram, like a year ago. Sean had like a photo, and it was like on the floor. But I have no fucking clue what it's worth. Give you another 150 credit towards the Aros. Bucks. What do you want? I don't know. For 150 bucks, I'll just keep it. For free par. <laughs> <laughs> You tell me, dude. It's your thing. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> You're killing me. I, I don't want to lowball you, too. Well, then part of me is like, do I even want to get rid of it because I've had it so long? Just, uh, just let me hang it here. <laughs> and then, and then, and then, if we ever move or anything, I'll give it back. One fifty to free, real quick. Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> just consign it. Just consign it. I'm just kidding. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. I really have no idea what it's worth. I just know it's cool that I've had it for literally ever. I texted you about it like I know. two years ago. I know. I don't know. I don't know what it's worth. I don't know anything. I think I've even asked like Facebook groups. I was like, "Is this worth like a hundred dollars or like a thousand dollars?" And everyone's like, "I have no fucking clue." What do you want for it, dude? It's not bugging me. <laughs> I mean, it's legit. Like Chinese. It's not like some free free pro. That's so. It's so dope, dude. You can tell it's old just by something like that. Yeah, no, yeah, that's sick. Like, and stuff like that. I don't know, man. <laughs> you let me know, I don't know. Like, what would you be comfortable with letting me go for? Oh, that's got sentimental value to you. Are you all good? Huh? Are you all good? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, you're good, buddy. Uh, you're good, good. What would you take? I would have to think on it, but what I'm thinking right now is the sign, those, and I have a dead stock pair of these in the car for the car. Yeah. So you got is it worth it for a sign? Yeah, I know, no, you're right, you're right, you're right. The Beechers, size 12? Put in your YouTube video. I did? Yeah. yeah, you paid four hundred dollars. <laughs> I'm gonna stop making. I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop telling you what I paid. How much did last night? How much did you pay for it? I need to get your shit, bro. It's my last para too. I had three of them. That's my last one. It's you. I'll do it. I'll do it. It's just too, it's just dope. I, I, I don't. Where else am I gonna find this? You know what I mean? I'm not gonna sell it ever, man. I mean, literally ever. I just I, I don't know where. Yeah, where else would I find it? I want it to go to someone that's like appreciates like yeah this this kind of stuff. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. I literally never sell it ever. It's, it it go above the fear and finger. I think so. All right. All right, let me go grab the features. So the pars are going to go home. The sign's going to go into a good home. I'm happy about it. It's actually really cool. Um, Hold it up. Yeah. See. This is sick, man. Shout out to Danny once again, man. The goat. It's so dope, though. I think it fits the vibe of the store really well and everything. But yeah, I think it's going to go above that mirror. I think that's going to look sick right there, right? Yeah. Yeah, we'll definitely do that. Only three. This guy's only got three pairs of them. <laughs> All right, well, let's go get this deal done for him. I think, I think he's a happy guy. <laughs> Anyone want to tell me what's wrong with this wall right here? Anyone? Well, just in case y'all were wondering, the shoes actually do go this way. I know it's, I know it's, I know it's kind of, kind of complicated, but the shoes do go that way, guys. Just <laughs> Seriously though, what the heck? Crispy. 
Yeah, I mean, they're, 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 uh, six fifty total. Three fifty these, one fifty for each. All leather worn. All leather worn. Yeah. You said six fifty. Yeah. We do some math real quick. Did you want just cash or just were you issuing credit at all? Cash or check. Cash, okay. Preferably. Yeah. Uh, it would be a little lower, bro. Um, what are you valuing each at? Because I'm, I'm just, I just want to understand. Because I am pretty quite a bit lower. Three fifty and then one fifty each. Okay. So I'll just tell you what I'm at, because these are going for like two. Okay. Um, I'd pay like 100 for them, and used, I'd sell them for like 160, 175 maybe. Okay. Um, these, I'd pay, I'd like to sell them pretty close to 350. Oh, yeah. um, I'd, I'd pay like 250 on them. Um, and then same thing kind of with these, I could do like 120 on these. Um, they're going for 180 maybe, man. So I, I mean, I'd literally put them yeah. at like 175, make 50 bucks, 55 bucks. So that would be... 120 plus 100 plus 250, 470. You're gonna make it up uh, 500 even? I can do 480, it's probably my best man for it to make any sense for me. I mean, I'm, I'm not really not making too much on it. Yeah. Yeah, I know these went down in value. Yeah, I, I mean, everything's down right now. Right, honestly. right, I paid 450. DS though? A year and a half ago? Yeah. Brand new? Yeah. I mean, yeah, that's about yeah. what I did, that's not. But now they're, they're a little bit mad at yeah. this. Yeah, I mean, I can do 480. Um, 480 you, bed, bed, you wanna do that? Cool. Right, cool. Yeah, we can do that. Cool. Uh, you have Venmo? Yeah. Or let me see if I have cash. If I have cash, if I have enough cash, we should give you cash. So let's just count it out real quick. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 200, 1, 2, 400, 50, 70, 80. Cool. Cool, man. Thank you so much, bro. All right, so a nice little bio right here. We got uh, the 1300 ALBs. This is one of the first, new, one of their first New Balance collabs. Um, not my favorite New Balance model, but definitely a good quality suede and everything. ALD is always really good about their quality with New Balance and everything. And definitely the uh, star of the show for this buyout, the Black Cement 3s. Extremely clean. Um, this is a good pair to have in the store. I'm glad to get these for sure. And then another pretty new one as well right here. The Supreme by any means. Um, this is probably the worst colorway in my opinion, but they are very cheap. So that is the, the plus side on these. Yeah, good buyout, 480 for all three. Can't complain. Yeah. All right, so Daniel picked up the pars again. I think we, uh, but I think we're both happy in the end of this trade. Um, so just to recap it, he got the um, par SBs right here, and he gave me the features. He's got them on feet. Raul just showed that. Um, crazy. He ripped. I didn't actually know this. He told me this. Daniel told me this the other day. But if you rip away this, it's like all rainbow under. It's pretty crazy. I actually did not know that. And then, they got some cool little hits throughout the shoe, but cool little shoe right here. And then he also gave me the Soleil from Burry Crocs. So both of these and the Nike sign from the 90s for the Paras. And we're both happy at the end of the day. Um, of course, man, I always appreciate Daniel holding it down and uh, always hooking us up with some good deals, man. And some one of a kind pieces as well. I mean, where else am I going to find that? It's going to be super dope on the wall. I'm really excited to hang that up. We'll show that in a second when it gets hanged up, but yeah, man. Appreciate it, brother. Always appreciate it. Man. Of course. Is that good? Daniel, can you tell me if it's centered? Uh, there it is. Day of the life. <laughs> Movie. Mm -hmm. Dude, look what Daniel just brought us. We worked out a little deal, but it's pretty dope, right? It's from the 90s. Where'd you get this, Daniel? My uncle used to like work with Nike and he gave it to me like when I was like seven years old. Sick, right? Yeah, where you put it? Right here in Buffalo. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. Show him the drip, Logan. Jesus Christ, Jesus man. This guy's Christ. always stepping out. <laughs> Holy Break shit. Break it down for us, please, man. So uh on top man, we got the we got the Pro GMT, yeah, yeah. the finished cards, and the, the sand fours, man. Jeez, man. This guy's always stepping out. Vintage attire only, man. Tugging on it a little bit, make sure. It's pretty not going anywhere, no one's gonna fucking touch it. Yeah, I think it's pretty solid. It's pretty light too. Okay. Good? Yeah. You show them the setup right now? What's going on right now? Yo, sketchy vibes all day. Alright, get that OSHA violation. Yeah. Alright, dude. Here it is. Put it up. Alright. Oh, parkour. Dude, that's sick, man. Yeah. That's sick.
Got to get a ladder here, though, for real. Jesus. Yeah. The problem with it, small holes, um, it's... So, uh, some new arrivals just came in. Little Larry Bird team, size large. We fucked, but we'll see what we can <laughs> do about that. Uh, Shaq T on the Reebok tag, size medium. Another beauty. We got the, the 80s Larry Bird character tee. Another dope one. Grateful Dead tee. Not much to say. Classic piece, honestly. And we got the Jordan tee. Same thing as Larry Bird, the character tee. Some sick pieces, man. More to come. Many more to come. New arrivals all day, every day. Stay tuned. The Vault DTX. Y'all know where we at. 1264 Main Street, South Lake. Pull up. Y'all know where we at. 24-7, all day, 365 days out of the year. We'll still buy them. Anyway. We'll still buy them. Yeah, we can still make deals on Christmas Thanksgiving. Always buying, guys. Always buying. Please pull up with your heat, vintage sneakers, streetwear, snapbacks, knickknacks that Daniel brought in. Stuff. Anything cool like that. We're open to it, bring it in. Anything Let's make a deal. Yeah, Anything and everything. All right guys, we finally got our card reader back up and running. So bye to the Shopify One Square. It's our new card reader. But man, this has been a pain. I've been dealing with this for like a week now. Finally got it up and running again. And yeah, come use your debit cards and credit cards in the vault again. Jeez, man. Finally, it's one of the headaches it is whenever you're trying to run a store, you got a lot of random stuff like this come up, so. Finally, got it to work, thank God. So, you guys are free to spend your credit cards in here and your debit cards, once again. All right, so bro's taking the green lobsters, just got these in just a couple days ago. So, nice little flip right here. Special box too. Sad to see these go. I like these, I like having these in the store. But yeah, about to check them out. I think I got a bag big enough for that special box, bro. I don't know. Yeah, I got it. It's about to be 80. I'm working. Get this on camera, bro. Because I don't even know what the special box even looks like. Yeah, I got you. Oh, it's like a. It's supposed to look like an ice chest. Oh, like a lobster? Yeah. I need to have more luggage. Oh, all your bands and your extra laces and more and things like that. Yeah. Sorry, no bags big enough for this, bro. Appreciate you, man, bro. Thank you. Take care. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you. What's that? The Grinches? What's that? The Grinches? Oh, 12. Yeah, you It's been a good day so far, man. Lobster's gone. Some Bulls tees, some Playboy Cardi merch, but yeah, nice little, uh, Back to back to back cash outs. Day in the vault. Yes, sir. Day in the vault, man. So uh, every now and then, the VHS will run out. And we have to pop it back in. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do that for you guys. All you have to do is just push it back in, and we're good for about another hour and a half. Playing Space Jam right now for all the the real sneakerheads. All right, guys. Day one of the books for vlog number one. It's been a great day. We sold a lot of great stuff. Uh, did a lot of cool trades and got the sign. Just a cool day overall. Cool stuff came in and uh, I'm pretty happy about it. What about you? Happy? Couldn't agree more. It's been a great day, man. Uh, we'll see y'all for episode two. Please stay tuned. We're gonna be doing two episodes a month. Um, so please stay tuned for that. I know it's not crazy amount right now, but I promise you guys, if the if you guys are loving it, we'll probably wrap up the videos coming out. But two videos per month now. This is the first one of many, hopefully. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys on the next episode. Peace, guys.